Nestled on the banks of the Hudson River, Mikey Stadium. It will play host to some of the nation's finest today and another thrilling edition of Army football. What a matchup we have in store. It's still early in the season, but this is a major test for a couple of squads who've gotten out of the gate undefeated. As we'll see a squad from the AAC, the Rice Owls, taking on the 12th ranked team in the land, the Army Black Knights. 48 Sports College Football, Reese Davis with you alongside David Pollock and Jesse Palmer. And guys, can't wait to get this one started. The offense lining up for a first down play. The option look. Ball is loose. A defense scoops it up and they're bringing it back. And that, those are frustrating, man, because I, I got to trust my running back, right? He's got to run in traffic. I got to trust him to take care of the football. This has got to be a huge part of my offense. Got to hang on to the football. Army has it back in the offense, ready to go. And the fumble on that last drive could have been much worse, David. They, they bailed him out. They held him to a field goal, so that's the good news. Now this offense has to get it going. Forget about the fumble, Jesse. Move on. Be positive. And they're upset with themselves, too. Uh, they're an offense that pride themselves on ball security. Let's see what they do right here. They'll run the option. Now the toss. At the 35, he's open. He will step out of bounds, but not before the big pickup and a first down for this offense. He's looking to throw it. Fires to the wideout. He makes a catch. Excellent job working through the air there, finding a hole in that defense and picking up a first down. And the Black Knights come to the line with a new set of downs. They'll try the counter. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. You know, the one thing you can say about this defense, they pursue the football. The first guy might miss, the second guy might miss, but there's going to be more and more hats flying to the ball carry. You saw it on that play, getting the tackle for this. That defender reacted immediately when he saw the play and just set his hair on fire toward the ball carry. And you've got to see those plays. Those plays are very fast. It happens quick. There's no fake to a toss. It's pitching on the outside, trying to get to the wide side of the field. Great job by the defense. You've got to set those edges by the defensive end, and everybody fly to the football. Now inside the 20, first and 10 from the 18. Motion by the back forces the defense to adjust. Smashes through. He's brought down, but there's a flag on the play. Let's see if it stands. Holding, They say you could call holding on every play. Well, they did on that one. On the Line gets set, first down. He'll ride his man on the option. Nice, solid form tackle from this sophomore. Second down coming up. Second down. A little pre-snap eye candy for the defense. And into the end zone. He rumbles all the way down to the two-yard line. He gave him a little bit of everything on that one. The Black Knights will try to punch it in on first and goal. Slams it ahead. And they try the middle of this stout defense, and they rise to the challenge. If you're going to stop the run game, you better be physical up front on the defensive line. They've got some maulers. They've got some dudes with bad intentions. Nice play there. He's knocked down in the backfield. He'll lose a couple. Man, that hurts because second down, you've got everything in front of you, the whole playbook open. Now you get a lost yardage play. Now it's third down. Now it puts those feet to the fire a little bit more. Now you better come up with something you really love in this area of the field. The big fellas coming out in the goal line defense. Needs to get it in the end zone on third and goal. That pass not close as he got drilled trying to deliver it. It'll bring up fourth down. 
Now it looks as if they'll settle for the field goal try. The cadets have it back as Army goes back on offense. They had to settle for the chip shot field goal last time, Jesse. They'd love for this one to pay off bigger. Yeah, it just comes down to execution, too. Did a nice job out in the field, stalled a little bit once they got down to the goal line. So they just need to be a little bit more crisp here today. Yeah, and listen, I think the first part was the most important part. you got to put the drive together first to get down there. Now, when we get down there, focus on execution and getting six points. They get him on the ground, and with that, we'll head to the second quarter. We've reached the end of the quarter, guys, and Rice has the lead. we put one in the books. Let's have a look at our game summary. Lots of time left, and we're ready to get back to it and open the second period. We've got this third down play to open the quarter. On the option. They'll keep this drive moving by picking up the first down. They have it at the 36. And you give it to the big boy. I like that. Those guys are really stout. They're usually not very tall, thick as can be, used to hitting linebackers. That's what they, they chew on linebackers for a living. I love when you give them the football, they lower the shoulder and get that first down for them. The defense got caught that time, and they finally get him on the ground at the 41. Not the most productive half for this offense so far, but finally starting to get it in gear. First and ten. And the defense makes the stop after a minimal gain. Got three on first down at second and seven. To throw, it's Bolden. He's got his man. He's run out of bounds, but not before. Turning in a big pickup and moving the sticks for a first down. And now a fresh set of downs for this offense. To the air on first down. Release to the back. The short hands. It's Russo. And he's brought down, but a flag is also down. Hold him, hold him, hold him, hold him. That penalty moves the ball back 10 yards. We'll replay the down. The offense set for a first down play. They'll run the option. Open space at the 25. Now on second down. Motion trying to get the defense to show his hand. Grab near the sticks. It's long. Touchdown, Black Knights! A great catch and run for six. I tell you, when this drive started, the defense thought they had them in a hole. Not anymore. What a performance. And I really like the play calling by the offensive coordinator on that last drive. That was a nice mixture of running and throwing and getting different players involved. Really nice job. Very poised in that play call. And it looks as if they buzzed down. Replay wants to have another peek at that last play. So after reviewing the undisputable video evidence, the replay booth has decided to overturn the call. And the Black Knights will line it up on first and ten. Goes to the option. Now the pitch. Plows through the defense. Brought down after a five-yard gain down to the seven. It's really frustrating when you get a guy in his spot. He's in the hole. He's there to do his job. And you can't get the guy in the ground. That's your job. Get him on the ground. You know, especially a guy that's not a huge back. you got to make that tackle. You can't make it easy on the offense where now they got to man. And he's loose, and he'll take it to the house. Touchdown, Army! And a great job by the quarterback making the right read. I, I got to get that defense to commit to me. Now I pitch it. Running back catches it. I'll take this. I'll do the rest. But it's a great read by the quarterback. 
Lining up to add another. And the extra point gives him a 10-6 lead. Let's go to the studio. Army has it back in the offense, ready to go. That running game was impressive, taking them right down for a touchdown last time, David. Yeah, just mauling. No secret play calls, just simply we are more physical than you, and we're pounding the football right at you now. So if you're on offense this next drive, take a look at their safeties and see if they're creeping up into the box. Because of your success running the football, this might be time to take a shot down the field and play action. That kind of pick up on first down, and you can take a shot here on second and short. He leaves it with the back. The Black Knights are stopped, but not before getting the first down. Really good looking running. When you play Army, you know these guys offensively, they are always so dialed into their rushing attack. Everybody understands their assignment and responsibility. It doesn't matter if they're running the option. It doesn't matter if they're doing it out of the spread. They know who they need to block. And as a defense, you better limit your mental... rushing attack down. And here comes the offense on second down. Here comes the option. And they try to run inside, and there is nowhere to go. Ball's at the 26. It's third and short, and they'd love to pick up the first down and avoid settling for the field goal. Looking to throw for it. Moving, keeping the eyes downfield. Trying to make magic on the scramble. He rolls all the way down the five-yard line before they finally get him stopped. These quarterbacks that just bounce and bounce and bounce and, and pull the ball down and make plays. Defensively, you just got to keep coming. You can't get tired. Um, you, can't get, you can't get frustrated, really. It's the frustration that gets to you because they keep making plays and keep getting first downs. Got another opportunity coming up. First and goal. Try to hold him to a field. And he got nothing in the line of scrimmage is still the five-yard line. They'll immediately call timeout. And the D deny them on second and goal. To the air, it's Bolden. Fires into the end zone. Touchdown, Black Knights! And they'll put that scoreboard operator to work and put six on the board. One thing this team has shown earlier this year, it does not take them long to find their footing. They get off to fast starts. That was critical for them, winning their first game, and you've seen it here in this one, too. They show up ready to go. There's no sleepwalking. I think you got to give this coaching staff a ton of credit for putting their players in good positions to have success. Now they'll line up for what they hope is automatic. And the extra point will tack another one onto this lead. Personal foul. Welcome to kicker. Defense. 
So they'll decline the penalty, pleased with the results of that last play. This offense has a first and ten. They are flat bailed out by the defensive penalty. We played two quarters here. Time to go to Kevin Connors in our halftime update. Fellas, one thing we can always count on is a great atmosphere in West Point. And it's been said football is a game of inches. And guess what? Based on the comparison between third down conversion rate today and the average yard per play, how can you argue that? I mean, the low-lying fruit is to look at some of the explosive plays we've seen in panic. But really, this game is going to come down to which team is more efficient when they have the ball and how they play when it matters most. The cadets have it back as Army goes back on offense. Things have been clicking along nicely, Jesse, but they have to make sure they keep it up. Yeah, they got to wake up. It seems like they've been a bit lazadaisical here the last few drives, maybe, as we've seen this lead dwindle a little bit, David. So they need a bit of a spark here to get that mojo back. Yeah, and you always have the adjustments, and then your opponent adjusts, and now they got to readjust now because this game's getting a little bit tighter than they like. A solid pickup there before the defense is able to make the stop. Here they come, trying to convert a third and short from the 28. They'll try to pick it up on the ground. Oh, what a move. And he surges up to the 36-yard line, and they'll move the chain. And the Black Knights will have it first and 10. Just when they're looking one, now up top. Got away from trouble and got rid of it. He throws back across his body, and it's picked off. Bringing it back. Offense bringing in the big boys, heavy personnel. Leaves it with the back. After the pickup of nine, it's second and one. Coaches always harp about staying ahead of the chains. And when you can run with that type of efficiency on first down, man, you are doing just that. The Black Knights get enough for the first down. So far, everything's just seemed to work for this offense when they wanted to run the football. Regardless of what down and distance it is, they're able to get it done. Up front, getting a lot of push, and these backs are finding the holes. They've got it at the 37. It's first and 10. The give to the fullback. That's what you expect from a senior. Don't give them any extra yards. Great tackle there. Win with the running game on first down, now back at it. Scanning the field, it's Bolden. Fires to the right. And the ball is picked off. He'll try to take it back. After making the pick, he took it. Army has it back in the offense, ready to go. Mistakes are going to happen, as they did on that last drive. Now, how will they respond, Jesse? And this is the kind of guy who's going to take full accountability. That was my bad. That's on me. I'm about to lead this offense now down the field. Dang, Palmer, I wish I would have played with you. I didn't play with many quarterbacks that were just like, yeah, my bad. Hey, guys, I got this. Sorry about that. It was more, you should have ran a better route. Nine-yard pickup on first down, and now they can take a shot on second and short. On the option. And how about that interior defense stuffing the run for nothing? Line is set on third down. Now on the option. Really nice job there to pick up the first down and get it to their own 41. Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. The give to the tailback. Nowhere to run on that one. He loses four on the carry. Couldn't get him blocked on that last one. Now it's second and 14. He's looking to throw. Unloads to the wideout. 
And it's picked off for the third time today. And he's wrapped up at Brace. The cadets have it back as Army goes back on offense. One of the most valuable things a quarterback can have, David, short-term memory. Just forget that last pick. You're dang right. Clear the mechanism. It's over. Move it behind. Some players can't do that real well, and it leads to more mistakes, Jesse. you got to just forget about it and move it. And I think the coaching staff can help him, too, David. I think you can get the running game going here and also give him some easy throws. On the option. And the Black Knights brought to the ground, but not before picking up the first. Well, this defense has to know that this fullback, he's not just a blocker. He's a guy that can carry the football as well. He wouldn't have got that first down. Finally, some signs of life from this offense, which has done nothing in the second half. It's first and ten. They finally get him stopped, but what a good job by that front wall to set up the screen and create some lanes for their running back. That was just a perfectly choreographed screen. The line got out on time. The running back had a wall in front of him. And I think the quarterback did a really good job of selling pass. And kind of... rush getting it to the running back and then let him do the rest you got him in space he'll pick up yards in a hurry on first and ten trying to strike from the 15 okay, ready? here's this offense with a fresh set of downs the option look. He'll toss it. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. You see all this movement in football now, all the stem in the defensive line. They're sliding right before the snap, creating confusion for the offensive line. Then they're moving back and stunting. Really good job by the defense. Continue to move, continue to stunt, continue to get in the backfield and make this life hard on this run game. So now, the opportunity to take the lead with a first and goal here. They'll try to get it in with the run. He's got it down to the one-yard line right on the doorstep of Pater. Second and goal coming up. Trying to power it in. A strong tackle and wrap up from the junior. I think coming into this season, they thought in order to have success, we have got to be able to run the ball and get this guy going. Yeah. Touchdown, Army! And in the final moment, they've taken the lead. This game has been incredible to watch, and the offense comes through late in the game, takes the lead. What a clutch drive by this offense. Now, I'm looking at you. Needs this one to push the lead to a field goal. And he knocks it through, and the lead is a field goal here in the fourth quarter. An impressive 66-yard touchdown drive. And what a late touchdown in the final minute that is likely the game winner here. Fielded in the end zone. It's Gore. 
Nice job executing all of the assignments as they put a stop to that return at the 22. No time to waste here. They've got to get set and pick up chunk yardage. Comes out throwing on first down. Working that left side now. Nice pitch and catch there, and they'll have enough for the first down. They'll get the timeout with five seconds remaining to play. Looking to move it through the air. He's going up top here late in the game. And the pass is incomplete, and the ball game is over, and this will be a game of what might have been. You want to talk about building confidence? Coming through with clutch plays making the winning plays at the right time can really set the course for the rest of the season. Yeah, Reese, maturity and experience matters. And this team has guys that have played a lot of snaps, they've seen a lot of looks, and they've lost close games like this in the past. That wasn't the case today, David. Too many guys out there making big-time plays. And I think belief is what you build. That confidence, you know you're going to win. You don't think you're going to win. You know you're going to make that play in the big moment that continues to build on week-to-week -week success. And you look up and you're like, dang, we strung a couple wins together. That's going to do it for us. For Jesse Palmer, David Pollock, our entire broadcast team, I'm Reese Davis. This has been another presentation of EA Sports College Football.